we can talk about Sam Howell, uh, somebody who entered the draft that you feel like should have stayed another year of school, and, and you really feel like that's the case with Sam Howell. Yeah, so if we go back a few years, Jacob Beeson, I wish he'd returned to Washington for one more year. He went from a fourth-round pick uh, when he came out to possibly being a day two, maybe even a day one guy had to return. He didn't do it, uh, and the Colts called it, cut him in the middle of the season. Last year, a different story. Davis Mills came out a little early, hadn't played a ton of football at Stanford, was a round three guy, had a good little stretch at the end of the season for the Texans. But if he had stayed in school and come out this year, he would be the first quarterback taken, maybe the first player taken. And now Sam Howell, I wish he'd just returned. He lost four starters, two wide receivers, two running backs to the NFL where a lot, they had a lot of success there and he was unable to make up the difference. And that's not necessarily a knock on him. If you lose your best players, you're typically on a struggle. The offensive line was, wasn't as good as Carolina had hoped and he just struggled uh, throughout the season. He had some bright spots. We some, saw some of those moments that he had as a freshman and sophomore last season, but not enough of them. And I talked to a team that basically said what I'm saying to you now. It, it would have made more sense for him to come back. Uh, he'll get drafted, may even get drafted in the first round, but I think it would have served him better in the long run to go back to Chapel Hill for at least one more year okay what about the other side maybe do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game the highlights the picks the instant analysis no yelling no fake debates no politics hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment